G'day! Today I wanted to show you a few things that I do on one of my songs, Still In Love. Um, it's probably the most commented on song that I have uh, at gigs and um, just emails and messages I get. Uh, it's a really, it's probably one of my favourite ones to play because it, you know, it can be whisper quiet and then it can just end up being huge. And I get, also get to do I guess a lot of my favourite things when it comes to soloing, using using a lot of sounds. It's a really nice progression of chords to solo over, I find. Um, and uh, you can just have a lot of fun with it. So the basic, the basic uh, chords are F, G minor, E flat. That's it really, for the verses anyway. And what I generally start off with, like to, one of my favourite draw bar settings, is just the first and the third draw bar. I like to put the percussion on, have it on second, and depending on the organ, I find because a lot of the times the percussion levels are a bit different. Um, this one I'm playing on today, it's actually quite loud, so I think that's fine. If I was to put it up louder onto normal, maybe a little bit extreme, but having said that. If I was using my kind of more distorted rig, then I would probably compress that down a bit and I'd probably love it. <laughs> so, uh, but for now, I'll just put that back onto soft. Um, so I really love this drawbar sound. Uh, I'll just give an example, I'll just play a little bit. Sound like someone being knocked over the head with a hammer or something. Just that, that real thud, that kind of clunk or whatever. I just, yeah, I really love that sound. Anyway, so that's the basic gist of the verses. Anyway, they're just they're just those chords. I like to solo for how long? Sometimes I might get really big at the start. Sometimes I just keep it mellow, and I'll come on, come in with the verse. Come home late. To fly half the house gone. I'll probably just hold these chords. I might do it. Oh, nothing to prove that you were ever here. On a glass where your lipstick rubbed off. And then after that, I do a big hit. So basically, as fast as I can, I pull out all the draw bars and just do a <laughs> slip them back in as fast as I can. That's well, just the way I do it. You can set up the presets to do it for you, or you can set up the other set of draw bars over here to do that for you. But you know what? I've, I've done, I've tried that so many times, and what ends up happening is I'm, because I'm in such a hurry, I just flick it, and I don't know if you can see that, it just ends up clearing. I mean, all, all these organs are different. Um, some of them, I'm sure, work perfectly, but when I'm trying to do it real quick, I always find it just clears and I get nothing, and it's like a really anti-climax, so. You know, I just like to keep my hand on the draw bars as, as much as I can. So there's a big hit. You can do a big gliss down as you put the draw bars in. Um, yes, yeah, so that's the first hit. Uh, Lips do rubbed off. Wow. Oh, so I pulled myself a drink and take a seat on this floor in denial. Where I feel the heat arising. Well, up my. And I crack. So I'll probably do a, one of those kind of sevens again. This time a major, uh, a dominant seven, I should say. But yet again with the actual dominant seven on the bottom, hitting the, the root and the dominant with my thumb. Yet again. Just 
just like that. Oh, that time I actually sort of slid off it. So started with it and then took it off. I'm still in love! Nice and big, all the drawbars out, generally. Quite honestly, I'll do it different every time. Still in love with you. I'm still in love with you, baby. There ain't nothing to him. And generally there, I'll start. You know, if I'm going from big to small, if I want to do it slowly, I'll start bringing these kind of shrilly ones back first. And then, from there, it'll be the second and the fourth I'll bring back. Followed by the first. Um, I'll just stop here and just talk about that for a second. That's the order. <laughs> well, I had to do a uh, clinic a while ago and I realised that that is the order I kind of do it in. Um, not even being particularly conscious about it. But it's the same going from small to big. I generally have the third. Get a bit bigger, the bottom. And I'll bring these two out kind of at the same time, the second and the fourth. And then from there, I'll bring out the real character and the, the nastiness. And then same thing, backing off. Of course, there's the Leslie involved um, and the swell pedal. Uh, it all plays an extremely important part, especially the, the swell pedal. Um, I think that's probably almost the most important thing about the organ. I reckon. Um, okay, so we're getting a bit sidetracked here, but um, yeah. So I mean, that, they're the only two parts to the song, apart from um, dynamics. So, you know, it'll hit the solo, and I'll probably break it down to that drawbar sound again. And I might even do like two note chords at the bottom here, just to make it sound even smaller. that I might actually leave the left hand out altogether because I like to do a lot of these uh, draw bar tricks you know, where I'm going. So yet again it's that same principle of making things bigger and smaller. Just having a hand on the draw bars and manipulating them just to make things sort of sound like they're being filtered or just bigger and have more weight as you go. It's, it's just another whole whole bunch of expression that you've got there, which a lot of people um, just kind of set and forget, and I think it's a real waste. Uh, that song I end up getting real big. Lately I've kind of just been settling on this uh, little pattern where I go... This is a cue for the band to know that we're slowly going to get really ridiculously loud. Yeah. Line up. Ah, sorry. And then quite often I'll just move up but keep that same rhythm, you know. all the way. It's me um, screaming my lungs out and getting very excited as I do. Uh, I think there was a few interesting things in that. Um, I'm going to elaborate on a lot more of those little things in some separate videos too. So uh, yeah, hope you enjoy.